Si bet lušimo automatai, lažybus, rulėti, stalų lušimai, neatsakingas lušimas gali sukelti priklausomybę. O, oh, I don't have any assist? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, sometimes it be like that. Um, you know, we won the championship. Uh, to be honest, we owe it to the fans, man. Um, I think they're a big part of what we do, especially for this organization, wearing that green and white. They made it feel like a yearly atmosphere tonight. Um, they were loud the whole game. Um, even driving to the gym, I seen a bunch of green and white outside of the gym. Um, it was crazy. So, man, I just want to say thank you to the fans. And we pulled this off today for, uh, for you guys. 32 points, uh, amazing stats. Uh, uh, what did Coach tell you before this game? It seemed like you had all, all the floor. Um, You know, I... I put that on me. Last game, I fell short. I missed two free throws. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. I missed two free throws, and I've been—I was thinking about that ever since. You know, ever since, ever, ever since it happened. You know, you go—you go back home. You got everybody on the social media telling you how bad of a player you are and things like that. So, you know, just me never wavering. Um, That's—that's that's something that me and my trainer talk about during the summer. Just never wavering. Never being too high. Never being too low. Just kind of floating and just staying the course. And I think that's what I did today, and just show show my confidence in myself. So. You came to Chalgiris in the middle of season. Yeah. What was your expectation for all the season, and how does it look now? Um, kind of like what it is now, just to win, just to win, and just to contribute to the team. Um, I know that I had a. This is probably one of my toughest pro professional seasons, to be honest. Um, especially coming to Chalgiris in the middle of the season, uh, picking up where Keenan left off. Um, Injuries after injuries for me. Um, I almost had three injuries uh, where I had to stop playing. Um, so it was kind of hard to catch a rhythm. Uh, coming to the playoffs, I kind of caught that just a little bit. Um, going forward, going forward. And, you know, I think today it showed. Uh, have you felt that rivalry with Jean Jalgris and Rivas during the Super I really didn't feel it until until we got to the playoffs. You, you know, like I really didn't. I heard about it. You know, Jalgris can't wear red and things like that. Um, I, but I really didn't feel tension in the atmosphere until we got to the playoffs. Uh, hats off to them. Like they competed, they competed. And that's all you can ask for. Like that that's kind of what makes the game fun. E even like with the trash talk, like that's what kind of player I am. Like I like when people talk to me, we're talking to them. It makes the game fun and you know hats off to them. They're a good team. It's your first one championship doing a different year. What's the feeling at all? To man, win the man, the feeling's good. The feeling's good. This is my first European championship. This is my first European championship winning the league and I did it with some amazing guys, you know, amazing culture staff, amazing staff and you know I just owe it all to them. Would you like to stay here in Kona for one more year? I would love to. Finals MVP will be announced tomorrow. Yeah. Do you have any idea who will be? <laughs> <laughs> Do you have an idea? <laughs> what do you I think? Uh, I'm thinking what you think. <laughs> I'm thinking what you think. But you know, whoever they pick, man, hats off to them. Um, it's a team sport. It's a team sport. You know, like I think, especially like on a night, on a night, he played a special game, especially that third quarter, kind of picking us up a little bit. Doby, Doby hitting some timely threes. Roe coming in. Roe didn't play last game. Coming in, give us 11, 11 early points. Um, you know, Iggy. Um, His one-on-one -on -one game, just coming down the stretch, just getting some timely buckets for us too. So I think that we all kind of played a part today. So it's a fourth quarter stretch, 11-0. What made the difference in the end? The energy, the energy. Um, I just think that we stuck together as a team. You know, like when you go through adversity as a team, it's kind of hard to stick together, especially like what happened last game. Me missing two free throws, um, we were coming down scoring. We turned the ball over the last possession. Like when you lose games like that, You kind of have to show character these these uh, these games, especially this closeout game. We're at home, we're in front of our fans, so it was a lot of pressure on us tonight, and I'm glad that we we're able to pull it off. You mentioned about those two free throws. Uh, yeah. Did it put uh, more pressure on you for this game? Nah, man. Like it happens. Kobe missed two free throws. Mike missed two too. Like it happens. Um, This is, the, this is the second time in my career where I've, I've missed two free throws. This is the first time where I missed the two and the other team won. So, you know, like I've been in those situations millions of times, 50, 60, 70 times probably in my whole career. And, you know, it's going to happen. Um, I got the ultimate confidence in myself. And 
I think that's that's kind of what showed tonight. Me just having that confidence in myself, bouncing back in, my, especially my teammates just believing in me. Them just telling me, yo, just pull it off and bring it home for us. And you know, that's what I did. Second quarter, where was uh, that beef with Marcus Foster? Have you talked with Marcus about nah, that situation? Nah, I ain't got no beef with Marcus. Uh, me and Marcus been knowing each other for almost 10 years now. Um, he went to Kansas State. I went to the University of Texas. So uh, when we were at when we were in college, we played against each other a lot. Um, he was he was probably the best player on his team. I was the best player on my team. So we've been competing for a long time. Uh, you know, he's chirping. You know, he's celebrating after he scores and. To, to be honest, that kind of makes the game fun. You know what I'm saying? Especially for me. Hey, um, man. This is him, not Jim. Don't get <laughs> <Yeah>. it twisted. <laughs> <laughs> and um, and um, that's what makes the game fun. That's what makes the game fun. Even though it's trash talking back and forth, that's what basketball is. It's a competitive sport. There's no hard feelings after the game, so yeah. I said, when would you like to settle your future? As soon as possible. Yeah, I need deadline later. I got no deadline, man. I don't, it's up in the air for me right now. I don't. Once my agent tells me something, I don't know. You guys will probably know before me because people tell me what I'm doing before I know. So, <laughs> to be honest, but um, but yeah, man, it's it's been a pleasure, especially to be in this green and white. Sure. You know, the international team, and they need some point guard. <laughs> hey, tell Coach to holler at me. Tell me. Coach got my number here. <laughs> Coach got my number, man. <laughs> Coach got my number. But yeah, man, it's it's been a pleasure just being here. Man. It's been a pleasure being here for sure. Si bet lušimo automatai, lažybus, ruletį, stalų lušimai, neatsakingas lušimas gali sukelti priklausomybę.